This weekend was a great weekend for young people. We had a youth prayer convention, and in my estimate, there were around 900 young people there. And it was concluded by a baptism of six young people. And then we had the march against abuse, and we walked three miles. There were more than a thousand people in the march. And I think this is a great testimony in the community, an awareness against abuse. I am passionate about that because for 19 years I've been women's ministry director and I had the privilege, the honor to hear so many people complaining about physical, emotional, financial abuse and even spiritual abuse. So it was an opportunity to say, we say no against abuse. We want to say welcome to everyone to this third annual March Against Abuse and connected with the Southeastern Conference Youth Ministries Young Adult Prayer Convention. We're so excited to let the world know again that we're marching and we're going to end it now. That is abuse, family abuse, children abuse, sexual abuse. We're going to end it now. And so we say join us as we seek by the grace of God to end it now. God bless you, and we pray that you'll continue to do God's will. Hi, I'm Jose. I'm from uh, Chiller Oaks SDA Church. We're here to stop abuse. If you're going through abuse, just realize that we're here. There's people that can help you out today, and God does not want you to be facing through hard times. God wants to lift you up today. God loves you, God cares for you, and there's people that can help you today. Um, and no matter what it is, just pray, find a church, and God will lift you up wherever you are. Thank you, hope that everything works out for you and your loved ones, thank you. I'm Pastor Juan Esteban Gonzalez uh, from Chile O, SDA Hispanic Church. And we are here because we want to support um, this march against the violence in uh, everywhere and every place and every people because you, uh, we like that the people be awareness that we should live in peace and in happiness uh, everyone, every culture and um, everybody together so God bless you and uh, please join us the next time Hi, I'm Commissioner Samuel B. Ings of the City of Orlando, District 6 and we're here today to end the abuse. Stop it now. We really are reaching out to our entire community and trying to make a difference. Violence is really not a part of our heritage and we have to do everything that we can to support our children, protect our children, and protect our community. So this march to end it now was a statement. And I am so happy that we were able to be here to do this and the Seven Day Adventist Church for coming out and being one of the sponsors of this event. Ms. Brise, thank you. Ms. Pates, thank you so very much for coming to my office and bringing this idea to me. And I joined in to support them and to support the Seven Day Adventist Church in marching in our community to stop the violence in the abuse now. Esta marcha ha sido un gran evento para la Iglesia Adventista aquí en Orlando. 24 personas cada minuto han sido víctimas de uno de estas maldades, de estos abusos y creo que la voz de la Iglesia Adventista puede hacer una gran diferencia en estas comunidades. Eh, cuando estábamos en la marcha, muchas personas eh, estaban levantando también eh, sus carteles y tomándose fotos con nosotros porque yo creo que la comunidad entera quiere un cambio, quiere terminar con estos abusos y ahora que hemos comenzado Eh, eh, es, es el momento para nosotros continuar hacia adelante haciendo una diferencia para terminar ya con, con los abusos que están ocurriendo en este mundo. Así es que eh, sigamos hacia adelante. Esta marcha eh, es el principio, pero vamos a continuar porque este mal tiene que terminar. Y gracias a Dios, la Iglesia Adventista es la voz que se está expandiendo ahora mismo en esta comunidad y en el mundo para que terminemos los abusos.